Nation, your girl is back with another mother freaking video for that ass, okay? By the title, y'all already know, and by the previous video, y'all already know what this video is going to be about, and it is basically revealing my insecurities. I know sometimes revealing your insecurities to others can be very bad because people tend to use that to hurt you and you know at this point i just feel like you know people people can talk you know what i'm saying people can talk it's not gonna hurt me at the end of the day one thing is that i do have confidence but i know i'm not all that like i know i have flaws and everything and I don't feel like I'm the shit. Um, but I, at the end of the day, I do have like a little bit of confidence. Now with these insecurities that I do have, to you guys, it might not seem bad, but to me, it is. So basically, I'll just be talking about my insecurities. Um, yeah, so number one insecurity that I had was my gap. When I was in middle school um i used to get talked about a lot about my gap believe it or not i know i'm pretty okay but your girl used to get talked about look i used to talk about in high school i used to talk about in middle school i used to get talked about period okay majority of the people that were talking about me were in middle school and it was always about you know my gap so <clears throat> hold on I take my returners out, y'all. Hold on. Get out of there. Hold on. <laughs> it was in uh, middle school. I used to always talk about about my gap, and to the point to where you know boys didn't want to talk to me. I will always have like this one friend. Her teeth was so perfect, and you know nobody would choose to talk to me because of you know my gap people were so like and people i'm not gonna say people were as in past because people are still picky they're picky about how they want this person to look and how they want this person to be let me take a sip mm. My gap was one of my biggest insecurities. And now since, you know, I got that fixed with my braces, and you know, now since my braces are off, it's like, it's a new me, uh, and I'm loving this new me. Um, I feel more confident in myself. Um, I feel like, you know, I am beautiful, but now I just feel like I'm even more beautiful. That's one of my insecurities. The second thing is my boobs. Like my boobs are like, like big. I'm not really a big fan of my boobs. Um, it's a lot of when I see girls complain about how small their boobs are, I'd be like, sis, I wish. Like, do you want to trade? Because you don't want these big watermelons, okay? What you complaining for? You have little titties. I wish I had little titties. But I'm not gonna say because some people with little titties do want big titties. I don't see why. But, I mean, everybody's different. Yeah, that's just um, the second insecurity that I have. Um, the third insecurity is my stomach. I can't seem to shake off this gut for nothing. And when I see these Instagram models, I be like, oh my God, like how? It's like they got the perfect body. Like no, they, they waist is snatched. You know what I'm saying? They, they, they just have a nice body. And then I look at myself in the mirror and I'm just like, sis, come on. For that, I do put that on me because I can be lazy at times. I could be like really lazy and you know, I just gotta work for it, you know? So I gotta work for the body that I want. And I was thinking about getting a BBL. Honestly, I was thinking about getting a breast reduction. At this point, it's like I wanna do what make me happy. You know what I'm saying? I don't wanna do what make others happy. Like people gonna talk regardless, okay? In the day, 
I don't care what others think. If it's gonna make me happy, then I wanna, then I'm, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go for it. I'm not planning on getting the BBL. That was just a, a thought, an idea. Um, I am thinking of a breast reduction. That is what I am thinking on. Uh, it's again, it's getting a breast reduction. Um, as far as the BBL, I'm just going to work out. And I know not only do I have to work out, but I have to start eating the right foods. And I'm going to start changing my, um, excuse me. I'm going to start changing how I eat. I want to eat more healthier now. I want to get more on the healthy side. And that's what I'm going to start doing uh, in another week. <laughs> okay, in another week, I'm going to start. Because this is going to be a big change for me. So I want to at least take this week, okay, and just eat. My teeth feel weird. And just eat, you know, what I want to eat, okay? I'm getting a week. I'm giving it a week, okay? And then once that week is up, I'm about to start in the gym and giving y'all little workout updates on my channel. Um, I found the perfect um, personal trainer thanks to um, the young lady that DM me. So um, I found a, um, a personal trainer, got in, uh, blah, blah, blah. got in contact with that person. So, you know, I'm going to be running it up with that personal trainer. And, um, yeah, I'm about to get this work in for real. Already got my own waist trainer, but um, I want to order a new one off Amazon. I want the um, one that's that um, actually not wraps, but um, buckles up like a corset type um, a waist trainer. I heard that helps more. And um, I'm gonna get woo. Cranberry juice with orange pop is not the way to go, okay? You see what I mean? Just give me a week and I'll be good. Um, so yeah, I got them a personal trainer and checking out and all that. But as far as uh, my insecurities, I don't really have a lot. Those were just the main three. Is my my boob. I always had big boobs, guys. I always had big boobs since freaking middle school. I always had big boobs. And I'm just, I don't like them, you know. I know I should embrace my body and how I look. But at the end of the day, I can't force it on me. If I'm not happy with it, I can't force myself to be happy about it. If deep down I'm not happy. You know what I'm saying? That's just going to make it worse. So why pretend to be happy about something when you're not? Um, I want to feel... I feel beautiful, but I want to, I don't know. I just, it's hard to explain. I hope y'all understand what I'm trying to say. Um, I'm, I'm thinking in my head, but as it's coming out, it's not, you know, what I'm thinking. Uh, so, yeah, I'm uh, working. Uh, as y'all can see, I got one of my insecurities down. So, I feel good about that. So, okay. Um, next. Future-wise, breast reduction, it is. I'm actually looking into that. And um, as for getting the perfect body I want, that personal trainer, you know, I'm working on that in another week. So I'm slowly but surely trying to do what it, uh, trying to do what makes me happy. Um, forget how everybody else feels. This is my body, my life, my happiness. And I'm going with that. So. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If y'all have some insecurities, spam it up in the comments and tell me how y'all got over y'all insecurities. Um, don't be ashamed to, you know, comment down. We all have insecurities, okay? Because nobody is perfect in this world. So, um, give the video a thumbs up. Spam the comments, guys. Um, click that button to get notified new uploads. And I'm on a road to 100K, so make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. And also, spam up in the comments. How do y'all feel with me without my braces like do i look different you know what i'm saying i've been told that i look different like a good different but no <laughs> oh i've been told that um you know i actually look my smile is actually brighter um so yeah i think my smile is actually 10 times prettier without the um braces so yeah i'm actually i'm happy but yeah, I will see y'all in the next video. Jazz Nation, I love y'all. And um, spend the comments with any video ideas that you want me to do. Okay? Peace out. Bye.
Oh, 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 oh,